Hey everyone, I have a great snack for you tonight. It is made with vanilla wafers. So delicious. Peanut butter. And a banana. They are so good, so delicious, and so simple. This is a great after school snack that your kids can make themselves. Otherwise, um, you can have it after work or just whatever. They are so awesome. And, you know, the kids can peel their own bananas and assemble them almost like a lunch -um or whatever those things are called. So anyway, um, what you'll want to do is grab your vanilla wafers. And however old the kid is, it doesn't matter. Even I like just um, putting a few of these on a plate. Um, you're going to grab some peanut butter. And you're just going to smear it on. Now you can eat these open faced or you can eat them as, um, as a sandwich. And um, yeah, however, they're just so good together. So put the peanut butter on there. Okay, and then you have your banana. And you're just going to slice the banana. And you're going to place it on top. Now, you can eat these open-faced, <laughs> or you can put another one on the top. And then you can give it a little smush and then you can eat it now so you can they're so versatile and they're so delicious together you wouldn't think you know maybe you already do this i don't know but um this is just a great healthy snack for any age and so what's so cute about this is that um i used to have my daycare kids make these and we would have a special treat and i would give them a little cover full of um sprinkles and i love to keep the covers um and recycle them from like peanut jars. Those are great little vessels uh, to put water in for water coloring or paint if they were painting. I used to have a different color just for the kitchen, so I'd put salsa in there and sometimes, um, you know, snacks and sprinkles and um, just whatever. It's about a quarter cup that of product that fits in there. And actually, at my desk, uh, when I eat peanuts. I just pour some in a lid and I know that's right around a quarter cup, so it's kind of nice for a healthy snack. Anyway, um, so I would give each one of the kids, or just, you know, do them for your teenagers. Wouldn't that be cute if, if it's their birthday or whatever, and then you make these little cute little snacks for them? Use the colorful rainbow um, confetti sprinkles. How cute. Or just have these on a plate for them. So I'm actually making these because my grandkids are coming home. My husband went to pick them up tonight. And so they're on their way home. And we're going to make pizzas tonight. But I thought when they get here, they might be a little hungry because it's kind of that, that time. And they're probably sleeping in the car, so they're not probably snacking. So anyway, I'm going to have a plate of these for them. Now, you can also eat them open-faced. They're a little easier and less messy. But you can still just sprinkle some confetti sprinkles on the top. So, you know, to make somebody's day and have them smile and um, just, you know, be cheerful for a second and something out of the blue, these are great little snacks. So I hope you take advantage of them. Um, any teenager or young child would love them. And, you know, it's so awesome. You can even spread some peanut butter on the top here and dip them. And anybody would just love these. So I just think they're cute. They're a healthy snack. And um, they will put a smile on anybody's face. So cheers to you. And um, I hope you make this snack no matter what age you are. Thanks for cooking the Julie way or snacking the Julie way.